three sea creatures, a fish, a seal, and a whale all have holes. Now it's time for our shoelace. that we got as a part of our supply roundup. Let's start with the whale. In from the back, pull it through, pull your shoelace through like that, pull it almost all the way through. You want to leave a little bit in the back though. You can hang on to that, hold on to that with your fingers and your thumb. And then come to the next hole, hole number two, go in from the front and pull it through just like that, in through the front, out through the back, in through the back, out through the front, go in. Go out, front, back. And back to the beginning. We did it. Now we have our very own lacing board whale. And when you're done, you can pull it back through. Pull it out. Back. Front. We're going in the opposite direction. you see that? Can you do this? You can pause the video if you want to. I'm just showing you how to do it. So you can do it on your own. Front. Back. And do you know what color that is? What color is the whale? It's blue. Now we can do baby seal. We can start at the tail or the back. Pull it in from the back and out through the front. Remember, hold on to it with your thumb and finger as you, you pull it through, so you leave a little bit sticking out through the back. Then you can hold on to it and set it down if it's easier. But hold on to it and then find your next hole. You can go this way or this way. I'll go this way this time. So we go in from the front and out through the back. And what color is this seal? Do you know what color this seal is? It's a brown seal. We have our own lacing board brown seal now. Here, you can let go of the other string now. If that makes it easier for you. In through the front, out through the back, in through the back, out through the front, in through the front, out through the back, in through the back, out through the front. What color is your shoelace? My shoelace is red 
in black. And we have a brown seal of our very own. Now we can go back the way we came. Go the opposite. And then we have a fish. What color is your fish? My fish is green. I have a green fish. Tell me, what color do you have? This time, I'll start from the front. I'll go in from the front. Or no, I'll go in from the back. And out through the front. Don't forget... Hold on to it so that a little bit is still sticking out of the back. This is the back. Go back in through the front, out through the back. Whoa! See, that's why you hold on to it. I didn't hold on to it. Did you see that? I'll try that again. My right hand forgot to hold on to it. There. Now, we'll go in through the front. Out through the back. That time I remembered. In through the back. And out through the front. Can you say it? Front. Back. Front. Back. Very good. Now I can let go. So we have one, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten holes. More holes than ten. Eleven. Twelve. Can you count more than that? Twelve is a big number. Ten's a big number. What number can you count to? Finally, out through the front. Very nice. Now we have a cool set of toys to play with whenever we want. We just need to store them. So they are kept nice and neat.
Did you notice we went back the way we started? Or the opposite? There, we can put them in our bag. And now, we can play with them anytime we want. Nice and neat. See, all ready for the next time we want to do some lacing. Even better, we met our own set of toys, so we can check that off. We have done so much today. We're getting to be very clever cats. Look how full our check sheet is getting for today. Checks are very important because the checks tell everyone how much we've done to become a very clever cat. Plus, it's fun to show off a check sheet full of checks at the end of the day.